when we are coming to speak about death, about the band death, one of the most important bands in the whole metal, and especially in the death metal scene, and even more in the American death metal scene. It's difficult to speak about albums if we come if we are coming to rank their albums. It's very difficult to speak about worst albums. There is there is not a, a, a bad album of death. Okay, so let's so-called worst to best list today. Okay, because for me, every of their seven albums of death and even of control denied. Let's say the eighth album, but it's not that it's controlled the night. Every album of them is one of my favorites. But here I will I will try to make the list from the less favorite to the more favorite. But every of these albums is beloved. So in the seventh place, let's say I will I will put the album Spiritual Healing. Their third album, <clears throat> and many people uh, prefer this album as one of the best, even one of the best, even the be the best of the best albums of uh, of death. Here also uh, we have the three, four, or fourth uh, uh, members. Three of the four members of of uh, of death. They are from the band from the awesome. Death metal band Massacre. In the second place, I will put their debut. It's a little, a little bit, uh, let's say, more thrashy, a little bit, okay? Scream Bloody Go. Okay? Scream uh, Bloody Go. And we have to remember that many of the, of the death uh, metal bands of these years, they, they came from the thrust metal okay one of also of the things that the de death the band death uh, gave uh, to the whole uh, death metal scene is of course their name death okay okay not only them let's say that uh, the dance the death metal scene uh, took the name also from them and also from the song of uh, possessed death metal from uh, the album seven churches but also in these years, uh, when they came out from, from, uh, from with the album Scream Bloody Gore, and here also the drummer is the drummer of Autopsy, okay? Uh, Chuck, he made, uh, he, he made a booklet, today there's a booklet, uh, not exactly an album, of the, the Canadian cold thrust metal band Slaughter, okay? Slaughter, and uh, you will find in this booklet that uh, Chuck played together with them in this booklet, as uh, you can see, Chuck together with them. One of the things that we say also, uh, Chuck is a Jew, is he was he was from a Jewish family, okay. Okay, now I'm continue with. Uh, their last album with their last album in the fifth place i will put their last album the sound of perseverance is also one of their good albums very progressive is the last album and the most progressive album of death as death and also the, here uh, they tried uh, they they made a, a cover of Judas Priest with the song Painkiller. In the next place, in the fourth place, I will put the album Individual Thought Patterns. Also a progressive, uh, let's say a progressive death metal album, a very good album. Afterwards, in the third place, comes Human. For me, Human, together with the two albums that will come afterwards, they are the, the top 
of death. Here also the bass, the bassist uh, bass plays Steve uh, Di Giorgio from Sadus. In the second place, I will put their second album, Leprosy, one of the most beautiful albums of death and the most influenced albums of the whole death metal scene, this together with spiritual killing. A so good album with songs as a forgotten past, left to die, pull the plug, open casket, and not only. For me also was the first album that uh, from them I, from this album I started to know death. So it's another also reason that this album is so close to me in my heart. And in the last seventh place, the best of the best of death of course, I'm speaking about the album Symbolic. Here, I don't have words to speak about this progressive death metal masterpiece. I don't have words. The best of the best. And I will finish now and I will speak a little bit about the, about the last album of Chuck. Not with death, but with his new band in these days, Control Denied. And this also progressive masterpiece, not death metal, but progressive masterpiece, The Fragile Art of Existence. Expect the unexpected, taught us Chuck, and unfortunately, after this album, he wanted uh, in these days to make another also album with Control Denied, and he didn't succeed. Unfortunately, became ill until uh, his death. So, rest in peace, Tzak, from Israel and from Jerusalem. Stay metal and stay heavy.